Tonight, an invasive bug is now in Tennessee. It's a threat to crops and ecosystems. In Middle Tennessee, Davidson County reported finding the spotter lantern flies and experts at the State Department of Agriculture, as well as the University of Tennessee, fear those destructive flies do pose a threat to vineyards in East Tennessee. 10 News reporter Aaron Velasquez spoke with experts and winemakers about their concerns. They've got a lot of crops that they can affect. They've got a wide host range. Unfortunately, fruit crops, tree fruits, and some of our vine crops like grapevines. Professor of Plant Sciences at UT, Dr. David Lockwood, says the spotted lanternfly can harm local crops by eating the valuable nutrients plants need to survive. It'll suck the juices out of the, the woody tissues on the plant. Since its discovery in Middle Tennessee, some farmers feel that they have to come to terms with its arrival. Know it's coming. Um, don't know that we can do much about it yet. As farmers and researchers learn more about the insect, they also are learning ways to fight it and protect their plants, which isn't as easy as it may sound. Well, one thing you could do is, you know, to provide more nutrients to the plant, but at the same time you're doing that, you're also feeding the, the insect. <laughs> If you see any spotted lanternflies, experts suggest you document where it was and, yes, kill it. They're a very beautiful pest. The, the adult is a very attractive bug, so uh, it might be a little bit reluctant to do something to uh, eliminate this thing. Farmers will continue to battle through whatever Mother Nature throws at them. I'll take what the good Lord gives me. I'll do the best I can to work hard. In Knoxville, I'm Aaron Velasquez. This note, if you do spot any lantern flies, the Department of Ag does want to hear from you. Again, those bugs tend to target fruit trees as well as willows, walnuts, and oak trees.